The recording of this race is sponsored by JB Transmission. Specializing in foreign and domestic repairs, trust JB for all your performance needs. Check us out at www.jbtransmission.com or visit us at 256 St. Mary's Road in Winnipeg. This video production is sponsored by RD Sales and Service Limited. We service what others sell. For all mechanical repairs, trust our professionals. RD Sales and Service is a proud sponsor of the number 17 Super Truck and Sprint Car. Number five of Rod Fiddler starting on the outside. Inside on row number six, the two guys that were involved together in their heat race. It's the Dodge powered number nine, sponsored by Enterprise Rent a Car in Winnipeg Dodge. Walt Morris, the driver. And starting on the 12th and final spot in the Penner Performance, Penner Body and Paint number 20, out of Bloom North, the driver is Kevin Penner. That is your lineup. 15 laps is the distance. This class, uh, one of the most competitive here over the years, and I'm sure tonight will be no different. Great racing here in the Superstock Division. Yes, it's this Saturday. The rental experience goes on out here. No racing scheduled, but get a hold of Derek at rentalracecars.com to book one of the final few spots for, um, for Saturday's test and tune and uh, the rental race car experience. And then a week Saturday, we come back here for the October 6th finale here at Red River Co-op Speedway. And that uh, may well include settling the national was owed a late model points here at Red River Co-op Speedway. Uh, Ricky Weiss going into tonight, I think was 11 points back and he won his heat race and looking to win that feature off the front row tonight and the odds are pretty good the way Ricky's been running of late. That'll give him a sweep is what they call it. That's 57 points, that's exactly what he's looking for at this time of year up here where that is home track. Our race director, Dale McEwen, giving the drivers their last minute instructions on the race receiver. They all have earbuds in their ears. They're a one-way radio, which is likely a good thing. They get to listen to him. He doesn't have to listen to them talk back. Mike Martin, the white 55. He is your pole sitter. He'll bring him to the green flag. This will be a great race. The front uh, six or eight cars is going to make this awful interesting. 15 laps for the Winnipeg Free Press and Odessa Auctions tonight. The Starbuck Credit Union Super Stocks are on the green. Here we go. The 55 of Mike Martin, the early leader, but Donnell DeRoche right after him. Right away, quick. Rod Fiddler moves to the third spot. Mike Martin with six or eight car lengths on second place, 0-5 of DeRoche. Fiddler at third in the five. The eight of 88, rather, of Veert at fourth. Scott Brown in the Dodge at fifth in the 15. Good racing for 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th. Great racing all the way through the field here. Tabitha Wasseluk in the 4 car looking inside the 5 but unable to complete the pass that time. Rob Gordon in the 5X moves on the inside of Kevin Penner. Tabitha Wasseluk spins the four car at the bottom of turn four. The bottom of turn three and four, Tabitha Wasseluk went around on her own, so she gets going on her own as your leader. Mike Martin comes down the front straightaway wondering which side to take of the slower number four. Lap cars. Tabitha Wasilik 
wisely moves up out of the way because she knows the race for first place is coming and she wasn't in it there. What a race back here. Sixth, seventh, and eighth place. Kevin Penner in the 20. Scott Brown in the 15. And the 5X of Rob Gordon are wailing away back there. What a great race. Not for the lead, but... On the front straightaway now, that race heading into turn one is a good one. From fifth through ninth place, the driver's setting quite a piece out there. Uh-oh, Rob Gordon loses the handle on the five. He carries on, though, does not bring out the yellow flag. Mike Martin was six to go as he rolls through turn two onto the back straightaway. Donnell DeRoche is closest competition in the 0-5. At third, it's a black 88 of Beards. Fiddler is to fourth, and the race for fifth, sixth, seventh is heading into turn three now. Great racing for that fifth, sixth, and seventh position. Uh-oh, Scott Brown in the 15, slowing on the front straightaway, the Dodge. The Jet Tools number 15X is slowing and looks to be headed for the pit area. He is. 15X pulls off the racetrack. Three to go for your race leader, Mike Martin. Paul Beard in the 88 car is catching the 05 of Donnell DeRoche. Now with about two and a half to go from where they are, let's see if Paul Beard's got enough to get to second spot as they work their way through turn four and onto the front straightaway. One to go for Mike Martin in the Reimer overhead doors. King Insurance, number 55. Top three kind of spread out. Fourth place a little ways back. Fifth place is Kevin Penner at this point. Here comes your winner, Mike Martin in the number 55. 05 of DeRocha gets second. Third spot. Goes to the black 88 of Paul Beard. Four spot goes to Rod Fiddler in the car number five and rounding out the top five, the 20 of Kevin Penner. So the big winner tonight, Mike Martin in the Super Stock Division. Reimer Overhead Doors, Scary Larry Signs and Graphics, Lettingham GM, Martin's Diesel Service, King Insurance, Nyakwa Pizza and Steinbach sponsors on Mike's number 55. He gets the green light, that means he weighs no less than 2,800 pounds, and he is sent off and head over to greet his crew and celebrate a little bit. That's an accomplishment to win.